Well, okay, since this one is lit up, and it's a big, fancy-looking door, let's go through there next. And besides, I'm doing the, uh, just the previous policy of working around these things kind of a clockwise direction. And now, now I'm finally caught up. This is as far as I got for the first time playthrough. So as I enter this door, I don't know what's in here. You don't know what's in here. I have more blocks, some of them raining, some of them going up. It's, co it's a convection, it's a convection system. We have blocks and I've heard that light up. and play music. There's a door I came in. I do not see an exit. All these blocks keep on going. Can I jump up here? Yes, I can. Can I jump up here? Oh, there's what something is happening with the Oh no, that's the door I came in. Uh, we have really big spider webs on the floors. Whoops. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. No, no, I'll get back in there. Do all of the, the floor tiles do the same thing? The different notes. I bet you this is teaching us to play a song. I bet you, okay, take a look at the, the the blocks to the side. We have blocks that line up with our, our rows and our columns. See this this one that I'm looking at, see this the, we have a four by four grid and these four obelisks across the way are at four different levels. Maybe we can make them match. Let's try if we... If that one's all the way up to... Um, let's see if it leans this direction. Yeah, this one would be up at here. So the next one would be... Yeah, that's down the, at the number three. Oh, wait a second. I didn't mean to hit that one. Oh, okay. They chime if you jump over them as well. Let's just... No, this would be the number two. No, that... Uh, no, okay, I need to... Uh, uh, okay, I will decide to number them from my feet. At my feet is the number one row and number four is up there. That's... Odd. Okay, well, let's take a look at this. Okay, well, first of all, that's from the from the doorway that I come in, facing this direction. This reading left to right, it would be th uh, two one four three. This one is. Oh, so those are almost even. No. Two one four. No, that's three one four two. Two one four three. Three one four two. Maybe I need to start writing some of this down. This one oh, again. Those the the first and the last are very very close to being even, but not quite. Yeah. Two four one three. This one's the easiest to read. That is four two one three. I don't know that this means anything though. Two one four three. Maybe if I started writing things down, it may an important pattern may emerge. Let's take a look at cross-reference, crossing these these things. Um, start here. So that one's a, a two. Say, if, yeah, it's, it'd be this one. It corresponds to that. How does it correspond to this one? Uh, 
is four, two. But it's four here. Okay, it's oh that's so Oh, okay. Okay, I'm wondering if I'm supposed to take a look at consistencies and inconsistencies up to find, um, say, for example, that this this one, as I'm looking at, the tallest obelisk, it would make me think that it would be pointing to that one down there. Or it could be this one here, depending on which way is the reference. But if we take a look over at this other one, it does not match... Up, if I was I mean, if I were standing here looking at this perspective, no, no, that doesn't match up at all. But if I look at it from this perspective, it also does not match up. Interesting. Because I, what I'm thinking is that there's a particular sequence to step on the squares. And I need to divine that sequence by looking at these obelisks. Or I guess these aren't obelisks, are they? No, the ob obelisks are the large, large pointy things. The rocks, the... <laughs> I forget what they're called. <laughs> Monoliths, maybe that. Except there's more of them. You can't have multiple monos. <laughs> I'll just call them rocks, bricks, pillars. And it's interesting that this one is so very close in height to this one. Maybe that that be a clue to pay more attention to the two in the middle. So this one, okay, if you look at it from this perspective, it's it's be talking about the square directly in front of me. If I look at it from this other perspective, it is not on. It is not. No, that doesn't match. Something I'm not getting here. Oh, wait a second. Did I not chime on any of them whenever I went in the middle? Oh, look at this. If you walk in the middle, they do not chime. This is how this is how to to what I tried earlier. Okay, so again, let's go back to the here. We start at this door. Let's look in here. Uh, which ones do I want to step on? I want to step on in the order. This is two one four three. So let's go. Two, one. This one we can actually complete this way, or unless it, it'll penalize you for stepping onto the sidewalk. There's four, three. Let's do it from the other perspective. If you start, if the if number one is up here, it's two, one. Let's actually stay on the surface. Four. Three. Okay, let's go back from this way. Let's say that it, it state. Let's do this two one four three from this perspective, staying on the grid the whole time. There's two. One. Four. Three. Nothing happens. Interesting. 
Uh, let's come around over here. So if I look across, I mean those th those two are so very close in shape, but this is a three one four two. Here, let's do it this way. Three. One. Oh, it, okay. Hang on. Start over. Three. No, oh, I didn't mean to do that. Ah. Maybe there's an interesting idea. Maybe it has to do with how many times you can bounce up and down on it. Uh, just in case I screwed something up, I want to step out of the room and step right back in to try and reset it. Let's go. Which which was the one that? This is the perspective that had the the clearest. That it is. You definitely know which one you're looking at. Uh, maybe I'm not doing a left-right order. Maybe it's telling you which ones to step on first and second. Step in the order. Let's try it this way. One. Two. Three. Four. Nothing exciting happens. How about that idea, huh? Okay. Uh, let's do it this way. Okay, so, well, since I already stepped on that one, let's look at it from this perspective. Let's go... F if, if this is four, then two would be up here. Two... One. Three. Nothing happens. Uh, try him. Well. This one also. So, okay, this one is two, one, four, three. Four two one three. Yeah, that's the two one four three. Four two one three. Uh, so close to tell those those. Yeah, I wonder if I'm getting this just totally, totally wrong. And I'm not paying any attention to the corner pieces either. Perhaps this has something to do with it. Let's just take a look here. Corner pieces are all of different sizes. And of course we're missing this one. Because there's the door. Let's take a look straight across. Oh, I'm starting to get kind of stuck. I have the sneaking feeling that I'm missing something obvious. Hmm. If you jump high enough, you can get across these things without lighting them up. And I'm jumping right on this one. And it is not chiming again. But we jump on another one earlier. I could have sworn that some of these they'd... Okay, maybe... 
I was mistaken. I thought that they, you could jump on down and get one of these to chime multiple times. Am I supposed to be paying attention to the tones? Trying to map these out? Learning how to play a song? Do I have to play these rhythmically? Ascending. How about the next row? Is this also ascending? No. But this row is ascending. How about this one? No. Interesting. So, if this one is ascending, if we take a look from this perspective, let's try it this way. Dun, 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 dun. I'm listening for patterns. Boom, 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 boom. That one plays. That one plays a nice tone. Interesting. Okay, so this, this. So as we came in, th that one definitely has an ascending tone, but this one actually has a kind of a pleasant. Uh, or is it that that row has a common tone to it? You know what? I am going to kind of think on this. I think I'm actually going to cease recording for a while. Uh, yeah, I'm going to puzzle on this one a little bit. I'll probably come back a little bit later. But yeah, I'm going to stop for just for now. Yeah, let me return the game. Oh, yeah, here's that map that showed up earlier. Yeah, there's the room that, that with all the multiple hallways. Let me see. Okay, here's where I entered. Uh, then I came into the, the central room with the circles. Interesting, the map shows up now. I wonder why. And there's, yeah, I went into, this is the room that had the TVs. I went around, we turned things on, we came back. Any case, yeah, I'll stop and we'll come back to us later. Yeah, I'll talk to you later. Bye.